Hey, what's up everyone, Game Dad here, and I am super excited because we're going to unbox something today. I'm going to be opening this for the first time, and I am very excited to find out everything that is in this. If you saw my Korg's convention video, I alluded to this unboxing coming, and if you have no idea what I'm talking about, oh, here we go. It is the Horizon 2 Forbidden West Regala Edition. Now, I already have the game, I've already beat the game, and I normally don't buy statues and stuff for games because they take up a ton of space, but I love this franchise, and I was really excited by this. So, yeah, we are gonna open up the Regala Edition, and I'm gonna take y'all along for the ride. So, uh, ooh. Ooh, there's stuff in here. I'm just gonna open up the flaps, get the box out of the way, the like shell of a box, oh my God. This thing is heavy and awkward and hey, it's me. Drop me a like and a subscribe for uh, self-deprecating humor, thank you. Okay, what do we got here? Wow, it's got really cool artwork on it. Look at that, that's awesome right there. Oh, and it's like a whole scene. That's cool. That's really cool. Okay, let's go to the top down. No, no, I got one more thing I gotta take off here, it seems. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Okay, wait, how do I do this? I think I need to lay it down. Okay, we're gonna go to the top down camera. Here we go. So, there we go. Let's, uh, let's pull this out. Oh, man. Wow. That, this piece alone is like a solid, like three pounds of cardboard, jeez. It's like a little nightstand, coffee table. Okay, here we go. Check it out, it's plastic. That's really cool. Okay, and if you can't see the whole thing, oh, there we go. You can't tell what it is, at least I can't. It's supposed to be, I think, a tremor tusk or something like that, it's the giant elephant creature. So, uh, how do I take this out? As you can tell, I have never gotten a game statue before. I don't know what the process is here, so I'm just taking it out of the plastic. And then we'll look at what's in the little drawer after a second. Okay. Oh, we have a statue. How do I, oh, it's got tape. Okay, so let's cut the tape. All right, and then I'll probably be able to take the plastic off. Nice, okay, here we go. I'm gonna cut the tape there. There is a lot of tape on this. Just going around the whole edge. I think I got it all. Let's find out. Oh. It's really loud, sorry. Okay, and I got some extra little pieces in there. We're gonna have to check those out in a moment. Um, I don't know where to put stuff. Okay. Stay. Stay. Whoa. Look at this thing. That. It's freaking awesome. Does it come with instructions? There was a paper back here. Is that instructions? It might be. Dang. Okay, how do I take this out without breaking it? Do these things break often? Whoa. Look at that thing. That's freaking cool, man. The detail on it. And yeah, it's definitely, it's not all put together. I gotta put some stuff together on it. So let's see, what, what all do they give you? What are these things? Wow, that plastic's really loud. Sorry to your ears. Okay, I got those pieces out. I don't know where they go. Okay, here's other pieces. I also don't know where they go. Oh, that was loud, sorry. Ooh, elephant trunk. And there's the little Aloy. How do I, there's tape everywhere in this thing. There we go. Ha, look at that. It's a little Aloy. Nice, here, closer shot right there, maybe. Wow, the detail on that thing is awesome. Very cool. Okay, oh, as I just drop it. Okay, I got everything out of the plastic. I think, is this instructions? Whoa, it actually does give instructions on what you're supposed to do. Oh yeah, because there's like, supposed to be like a focus and all kinds of stuff in this. Let's see here. Ooh, it's an unboxing and a put together session. 
How do I do, wait, does it have, oh, it's got a battery tab. Why, what does it do? I don't know, but it had a pull tab on the battery. Okay, so let's see here. I'm gonna try and fit this as best I can in the top down, and let's see if uh, we can't get this thing put together, shall we? All right, and we're back. I got all the stuff added on. I figured out it was color-coded partway through. Look at this thing. That's freaking cool. I've never gotten a statue before. I'm really excited to have this kind of statue. I actually have uh, the long neck Lego set up there. That one's pretty cool too, but wow, this thing is awesome. And it's got, I don't know if you'll be able to see it in the eyes. No, you can't really see it on camera but the little eyes have LEDs, so you can turn them on so that uh, they're like yellow for alert uh, and blue for searching and uh, red when they're on like high alert, ready to attack. Oh, and I just noticed there's like a little like warrior guy on top of uh, the tremor tusk right there. I think it's a tremor tusk, isn't that what it's called? But yeah, uh, yeah, tremor tusk. That's cool, okay. Let's take a look at what else is in this thing. So that was that, now it's, this is a backdrop. I had no idea. Oh my gosh, this is gonna take up even more space now. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Look at that. It's a backdrop for the Tremor Tusk. That's cool. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna set that right there for now. I'm really excited about this. I don't know if you can tell, but uh, here we go. We have another thing here and it's a drawer. We open the drawer and we have the art of Horizon 2 Forbidden West. That's cool. Ooh, crack the spine. Okay. Let's see, what do we got in here? I'll show a little on the top down here. That's awesome. These are such beautiful games. The landscapes, just flying around in them. Oh, so awesome. If you have not played these games, you absolutely have to. These are amazing. Okay, and this was cool too. It comes with an actual steel book of the game, which I find amazing. Uh, and apparently it comes with a code for the digital game, but I have the digital game because it was part of PlayStation Plus, but then I also have the physical game because I wanted it. Um, so, I mean, maybe I'll put a code down below and you guys can get a free copy of the game. But yeah, I love this steel book. This is so nice. Like, is it an official steel? It is, it's an official like steel book. It has amazing artwork on it inside and out. Very cool. Now, this was supposed to come with like a replica focus. Let's see, that's the little like thing that she wears. Is it, oh, there's another layer. Okay, okay, let's put these back. There's another layer down here, folks. There's more stuff. What do we got here? What is this? Let's take a look at whatever this thing is. Looks like maybe some sort of art cards or something. Let's see here, we're gonna open this packaging and we're gonna find out. This is, what is this? Ooh, they're like, they're soft, but here's one, it is a feather. And here's one that is Aloy, very cool. So yeah, a couple of like art cards or something like that. I don't know what they would specifically call them, but yeah, we'll put those back in there. And then, what do we got here? Oh, I remember seeing this on the box. This is a fabric map of the game. That's freaking cool, man. Okay, let's see here. I'll have to find like a frame or something to put this in so it doesn't get messed up. Whoa, it's a big map too. Wow, look at that. I, I'm not gonna be able to really show it all to you, but it is a world map and it shows all the different tribes and all that. Here, let me see what I can do as far as the top down here. So here we go. I'm doing as best as I can to show you everything that is on this map. It is very cool. It obviously does not include Burning Shores, the DLC,
but that's probably because this came out before there was a Burning Shores DLC. Uh, but this is awesome. I love feelies in games. They just, they make it a better experience, a better, uh, it's just nicer when you get extra things. Now, let's see here. We have the Replica Focus. Wow, can you actually wear it? Hang on. What is it? Oh, it lights up. Look at that. That's awesome. Let's see, can I wear this thing? I have rather large ears. What do you guys think? I feel silly wearing that. Now, the other thing that this has, oh, is apparently a stand for the Focus. There we go, that's cooler. I like that better than me wearing it and looking special. But it comes with a couple of game pieces from the uh, the Striker game, I think is what it's called, Striker game pieces. But very cool, as you can see right there. But that is everything that comes in this. This, this is a really cool collector's edition, or sorry, Regala edition. But uh, yeah, I am very excited about this. Again, huge Tremor Tusk. Comes with a bunch of other little feelies too. Look at this thing. That is awesome. And that is gonna go on the shelf here in the game room. I'm very excited about this. If you all want to check out another unboxing that I did, then go ahead and check out this area right here. And as always, I'm Game Dad. I thank y'all for watching, and I'll catch you later.